Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another Logging from Scratch episode. Uh, last time we were playing, we were doing some unloading at the mill. I think it's about time we uh, maybe do some more cutting. So, we got a blade on this guy now, so we can also make some road, hopefully, as long as the game doesn't crash. Um, we should be good. I did some more testing with it, and I haven't had it crash yet, so I don't know if that was just a fluke random thing that happened, but I'm hope hoping it's not due to this blade, because that would be unfortunate. Um, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to follow this little road out and keep going down here. And then maybe we'll do like a straight cut into that other block. I don't really want to clean this out because it looks kind of cool in here. I like having a little bit of trees to make the bush road. And then uh, we'll go up here and maybe cut out kind of a designated block area. All right, so let's maybe, let's go up the skidder road, actually. Let's go do some skid cutting up here. Right up to the top. These skidder roads are actually pretty cool. I think it'll be fun once we actually get our skidder up and rolling. <clears throat> Oh, man. Um, so, I think I made kind of a loop back to that other block. So, what I'll do is maybe we'll just start kind of clear-cutting somewhere when we get up to the top here. We could have skitter races. Skitter races for the win. I just love building these little uh, areas like this where, like I said, we built the road, we built the area, we built the memory. I think it'll be so much fun. Oh, looks like it's getting a little darker. We might be doing some night bunching if this keeps up. We can probably turn our light on. That'll make life a little bit easier to see. Okay, so let's, um, let's cut out up here, I guess. Well, of course, we picked the one area where there's, like, no trees. We'll see what we can get out of this. Let's, uh, let's cut down all through here. That's what I think. I see our marker tree over there, so that might be the end of our, uh, purchasable area. Oh, I was gonna play with this thing. We're kind of going back and forth, uh, oops, on the buncher blade. So, or the buncher head. Trying to make, a, a one that's pretty effective. So, I just keep using this crappy one for our single player series, because I don't want to... I don't want to show you guys the new one until it's 100% ready, which it definitely isn't. I know a lot of people are waiting for this buncher, but a lot of people are waiting for everything because when I first started, everybody was, oh my god, we need the loader really bad. I'm like, yeah, I know, I'm working on it. And as soon as the loader comes out, they're like, great, okay, now we need the buncher really bad. <laughs> it's just like, and then the buncher's going to come out and you're like, hey, we need the skitter really bad. Okay, and then the skitter's going to come out and you'll be like, we need whatever, a truck and trailer and helicopter and a little bit and so I realize everybody wants everything, and that's totally cool, but we gotta kind of move as we move here. One bit at a time. Oops, uh, since we're skidding downhill when we do get to skidding, we'll put it this way. Always remember to know where your block is. Actually, having that blade on the front is really handy too, because you can see it kind of where your tracks are facing. Kind of helps. I mean, I've just gotten used to knowing where they are based on hammering through, moving forward and seeing where it goes, but I think that might help some people out. And we'll throw these here. Cool. I'll put all these little random skids all over the place. And I think I'll just, yeah, we'll just clear cut this whole uh, side here. And let's actually go this way with this one. And I'm going to kind of lay this in a bit of a sloop here. Hopefully it doesn't roll too, too bad. Let's actually go for the longest tree for this one out. And then come back. 
And I want to leave this one here kind of. So let's cut only part of it out. I want to leave a high stump because I think that's where it's going to... Oops, it's where it's going to lay up against it. Oops, oh no, we're losing it. I'll just lay that right in there. And grab this one. And we're just gonna back straight up. Man, we really need a buncher body. It's so weird using such a tall machine for what we're doing. <laughs> it's not right, man. It's not right. But we're working on that. I don't know what we're going to put out first for a bunch of money. We got the 909, the 822. Those are both uh, hanging out. Yeah, that's good right there. Perfect. And we're going to clean this up. Check it over here. And go here. <laughs> That's normal. The trees fall totally realistic sometimes, let me tell you. It's kind of on a pivot point, that one. That's probably why it's being all wacky. Things just like a bug zapper. It's, it's All right, now we're gonna go grab this guy. And then I think my next episode, I'm going to do um, sorting out that other block. Um, just kind of bringing all the trees together so when we do send the truck through there, it'll all be kind of in ready position. Because we didn't really sort it, we just kind of left all those piles from the processor. So that might make life a little easier. And I'm also going to grab these ones on this corner here. Or at least just these little ones here. Oh yeah, that's the turnaround for the skitter right there. Perfect. So let's actually, let's put these right up in here. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work, kid. Ooh, it's a heavy one. Heavy log. Basically just want to clean these guys out of here. We try for two. Oh, 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 we're gonna be brave. It can be done, it just doesn't like it. <laughs> oh, man, those are heavy. <laughs> it did it though, we did it. Just very heavy. And we'll grab this ugly little guy here too. There we go. This will be fun to come up here with the skitter one day and clean all this up. And bring it down roadside somewhere and process it down there. That's my plan. Now, I just got to do a little layout check here. How are we in reference to the rest of this stuff? Where's our main road that we dug out? Down here somewhere? Our main road is way down here. Where does it end, though? By this rock, I think, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're not far off. So we're kind of chopping up in there. And then this is kind of the block here. So I think this is the end of our block right here. As soon as we hit that tree line on the outside, those marked trees that Chad did there. 
So basically everything in here we can basically free fall. Which is pretty sweet. I'd say let's use this rock as a marker and just cut all of this out as far as we can go. It's going to be a lot of trees, let me tell you. And then here we got this section happening. All right, well, let's keep cutting, man. We got a lot of uh, a lot of chop, chop, chopping to do. And we'll just lay everything kind of in this little hole here. Technically, you could turn this whole area into a block if you wanted to, like to uh, come in new roadside. Roadside loading. But this will work out just fine, too. Probably better to skid this stuff out, to be totally honest. And then we gotta actually make a grapple skitter that works half decently. That'll be a fun that'll be a fun mission. Uh ba 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 boom. We'll get this stuff here. Actually here. I'm gonna hit escape so we save. And we're gonna try a little bit of plowing here, I think. We'll just plow this whole area out here. Kind of a wacky little landing spot here. And then we'll put a little skitter road all the way down here. Just checking my console, I don't see any errors. It was really weird that one time when it did that. Do a little skitter road down here. And then I think we'll turn because we're going to hit that line right there. So we'll do this kind of a slow turn this way here. This will be for our little our little skitter. it'll be easy to pull this stuff up. And then I can just lay it roadside. Back up, grab it. Room gone. Now where are we in conjunction to our big rock? Oh, it's way down there. Okay, so we got a lot of room up here. And then I'm going to make a little turnaround right in here. Because by the time we get to that other block, we'll be just burning back over our own stuff here. So should be fine. I'll just make a cute little circle here. If I hit V, or I have this button on my controller now. If I hit it, it drops the uh, blade down, so it's quite nice. Just kill it. There we go. And then just remember to hit G so that your claws active again, or else you'll go to cut a tree and it won't work. <laughs> So now that we're down here, maybe we should uh, lay some down here as well. Just so we don't have everything in the same place or else it's going to get pretty laggy. Do we have our blade on? Oh, there we go. Lay down some of the easy stuff first. 
before we traverse too far. Oops. That's funny, I saw this uh, video of a uh, processor, and it was actually on one of those little mini machines, like one of those little mini excavators, the tiny little ones, like the one I was running, uh, the one I was running from my uh, buddy's place there, it was just a tiny little excavator, but the guy had a processor head on it, like a little, uh, it wasn't like a Waratar or anything hardcore, it was just the, like a little... I don't know, I call them a walking processor because it like grabs, then reaches ahead, pulls itself up, um, and does that. Okay, I don't know what happened to this poor tree. What the heck? Let's check the collisions on that. Oh, that's interesting. So the collision starts there. Weird, man. It's like it's not even a... Oh, okay. So if I cut it off, like, right here... <laughs> what? What in the wild world of science is going on there? We'll just tuck that tree over here somewhere. Can we push it underground so we don't have to look at it? That is so weird. Oh, there you go. Bye, tree. <laughs> okay, then. Sure, why not? Why not, indeed? So let's uh, just throw that top over there. I have no idea what to do with that. That was so strange. I've never seen anything happen like that before. Not in this. Not in this game. Bizarre. This game's always a mystery to me, some of the things that happen. It's like, what? Alright, we're going to lay down one more pile, and I think we'll probably be at the end of our little video here. And then the next one, we're going to go play with that block, clean up some of those trees. We're setting this one up for a skitter, so that means I guess we're going to have to make a skitter sometime between... Eventually and now. Let's lay these in here... I gotta fix that. That drives me nuts. But I don't want to really fix this thing because I'm like, I'm not gonna fix the buncher head that we're not gonna use. I'd rather work on the real one. But we're getting there. Very, very slowly, but we're getting there. And we'll turf this bad boy in here. Whoops. Oh, don't cut. Okay, whatever. We're just going to lay it in there. Heck with it. Might still be able to grab that. And... I think what I'm going to do as I walk, I'm just going to lay them behind me so I'm not obviously being stupid about it here. So let's grab this one. And I'm going to lay it all this way. Like this. Oops. There we go. It's slippery. It's a soapy log. Very heavy log too. Holy. <whistles> you have to add the sound effects because they're not actually in there. <laughs> Why not, man? Why not? And we're going to lay that one down here. Now, we don't have to kill every tree in this block. I just want to kind of make a cutout. Alright, we'll get this one that we'll call it for now. Oops. Because I want to kind of get down there and cross that river eventually. That'd be kind of fun. Using all our technology that we develop along the way. Alright, let's park this guy up here. And we'll continue the walk after. Beauty. 
Take a picture of that beautiful mess that we made. So yeah, once we do get the skitter, we can come down, grab these, and then just run up the trail, basically. Drag it up there. Uh, these ones I don't know what I'm going to do with yet. I might lay these kind of inward a bit. Kind of like I did with these ones. Then we'll have to just keep going. This is kind of another little drop site here, so... A lot of wood, and then we should be able to, in theory, drag it down this trail if we pull it up close enough on the machine. And then drag it back down. Maybe we'll just make this central block town right here. <clears throat> we'll cut out a big circle right here. Almost to the road, but not quite to the road. It's funny because the main road's like right there. We could technically pinch into that main road with like a new road. But I don't really want to do that. I want to use this beautiful road that we made because that'll be fun. So anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. So if you guys like the video, leave a like, leave a comment. Do not forget to subscribe. And if you're in the bush, don't forget to hug a tree. All right, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.